Okay guys, so first you want to make your way to vShare. Okay, I'll have the link in the description, so don't worry. Okay, click on that to download for Windows. And then click on the download one. Sorry guys, I had to shut the camera off, but that's alright. After you go through all the installation processes, you just want to click on that install vShare. Okay? And it'll start installing to your iDevice. Alright guys. I forgot to mention, while you click install on vShare with your computer, make sure your device is connected the whole time through a lightning cable connected to a USB port on the computer. Okay. And once it finishes, it'll be right here. Well, not right here, but it'll be on vShare. And again, it's going to ask you to verify something in the settings. So you want to just go to settings and just go to general. And then you just want to go to profiles and device management. And it'll be named gtai8315 at cena.com. You just want to trust it. I've already trusted it. I'm really sorry about the low quality of these videos, you guys. I just don't really have enough resources to put together a good video, but I'm still trying to give you guys the help. Okay, so let's open it up. Okay, now a lot of the apps on here, well, not a lot, but I'd say about a third or something like that don't work because they're not on here yet, and this is a new service. This was just made by vShare not too long ago, maybe a couple of days ago or something like that, or a week ago. And so, apps will work, a lot of them, but some don't. For example, movie boxes on here. All right? But see, if you click on get the arrow right there, it just redirects you to the app store. And it just tells you that it's not available in the U.S. store. Okay? This just means they don't have it on here, but they are adding apps every day. But don't worry, if you, want, if you guys want... Uh, movie box you can just go to my last video that still works check it out if you want it you know it's right there but let me show you that this works okay so there's minecraft okay I've already installed minecraft with this app and I don't want to have to install it again because it took a little bit longer than I thought because my Wi-Fi really sucks but trust me guys if you don't believe me just try it for yourself it won't hurt you at all okay so it's been down I let it download once it finishes downloading, it'll prompt you to install, but I canceled the install. But even if you, even after you uh, install it and delete it, it'll always be in your downloaded history. So you can always install it again. So anyway, let me install it. Wait a little bit. Might take a little bit for that prompt to show up. If it shows up, that is. Okay. Okay. And then click install. Okay. Now, since I clicked it multiple times, it's going to show me multiple messages. Okay. It should be installing right now. Okay. And once it finishes installing, it'll be right there. So you click on it, and it opens back up. I don't know if you guys can see this or not. You might not be able to see this because I don't know if the screen recorder works in games. But it works, I swear. Okay. That's it. I'm sorry if this was a bit vague. Not very direct. Not very helpful. But I'm hoping you guys can piece it together. Sorry I can really get that high quality video that most YouTubers can. Uh, hopefully I can get some better stuff in the in the future I hope you guys figure this out and if you didn't just put it in the comments and I will try my best to explain it to you so as always guys please if you enjoyed and if this worked for you leave a like subscribe always greatly appreciated alright have a good day